Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Apollyon back with Legacy of the Escort. I hope you're all doing good. We just got a new game update and it did a game with some new items and a new set of armor, rank 13 armor that we are going to go and review and see if it's any good. So without any further ado, first let's go and check the new items and then check out the new armor. So first off, we have a new dark gold pet here looking really good. When it comes to the skill and as for the looks, let's check the preview here. So it seems like there are going to be some leaves and some hello beneath the bed there. Once you max it and it looks decent. But as for the skill, when attacked, there is a 40% chance to increase your total damage reduction by 80% for 4 seconds. This effect can only trigger once every 25 seconds. So looking good, this skill, this talent is looking good. And as for the inscribe, when attacked, if your HP is below 40%, recover 40% of your missing HP per second for uh, over 2 seconds. So this is going to be really, really good when it comes to HP recovery and as for the second inscribed skills attacks have a 20% chance to reduce the holy damage of the target by 35% for for second and again this is looking nice the second talent is looking nice so the pet is looks good and now let's go and check out the next item that is the T11 Ratming, I must say, looking really good when it comes to the looks here. Look at that, looks really, really good. Uh, green color, I like that, and the talent is looking really good as well. After using skill, there is a 30% chance to increase your total damage by 30% for a second. And if you can upgrade this, it is gonna go higher i believe 40 50 60 percent is gonna be the max value that you will able to get on this wing so it is looking really good here and now let's go and check out the new mount that we just got with the game update that is looking really really good i like the looks on this mount look at that line flying line here and if we go and check out the purview looks like it's gonna shine a lot some electricity effects coming out of that but anyways let's go and check out the talents and see how good they are looking so first skill i'm seeing critical damage let's go all the way to level 30 here seeing a lot of critical damage really so 50% chance to reduce the critical damage of the enemies within 80 range by 140% for 4 seconds and uh, it can uh, trigger every 15 seconds so this is actually really good it's gonna be good in skyfall and then the second talent here let's go all the way to level 30 tigers returns 35% chance to reduce the attack speed of enemies within 80 range by 50% for 3 seconds again looking good that 50% speed reduction is a lot and it can trigger every 30 seconds and as for the tar skill twin tigers let's go all the way to level 30 here 20% chance to increase your skill damage by 20% for 4 seconds cooldown is 16 seconds good skill and and i believe that that was the third skill and now let's go and check the fourth one and some attack speed is happening again here 35 percent chance to increase your attack speed by 50 percent for three seconds so again i'm liking this talent here the more attack speed you have the more attacks you will able to deal to your enemy and the more attack you will deal to the enemy the more talents you will trigger so that is good and then let's see the fifth skill here i'm seeing some hp recovery here 50% chance to recover 60% of your missing HP every second for 2 seconds. This effect can only trigger once every 20 seconds. So this is looking really really good. It's going to give you a lot of HP 
and the trigger chance is 50 percent so with these talents your hp healing is gonna be really really good and as for the sixth skill let's go to the level 30 again here and see 25 percent chance to increase your holy damage reduction by 40 percent for three seconds so again good skill there and we are seeing some more holy reduction at the end let's see 25% chance to reduce the holy damage of enemies within 80 range by 40% for 3 seconds. This effect can only take once every 12 seconds. So, so looking good so far here this mount on the talents. And now let's go and check out the divinity. When attacking there is a 16% chance to increase your total damage reduction and skill damage reduction by 60% for 4 seconds this effect can only trigger once every 16 seconds so divinity is looking nice nothing really too special but the uh, values are really really good 60 percent and i believe if you can upgrade this more evolve the amount more that 60 percent is gonna go higher maybe 70 80 90 and even 100 something it will go so looking good this mount and now let's go and check out the new armor that we got with the game update all right let's scroll down and see if we can find the new armor set and we can ancestor set and it seems like we need something new here to uh, fuse these armor sets now this is gonna be something new scale of the dead dragon material needed to fuse uh, R13 equipment. So where can we get that? I don't know yet, but let's see if it has some new look and doesn't seem like it has a new look. But let's go and check the awaken here. Do we have any awaken for the R12? And I don't think we do. So what do we get from these? things here maybe only the uh basic attributes well i'm only seeing the basic attributes here no way attributes for having a complete r13 set maybe i'm missing something but that is everything guys i'm gonna sign off now i'll i'll see you guys later with something else till then have fun and take care guys